Hi, I'm Greg Johnson, director of resourcesforlife.com, and this is a brief video following up on our first of what I hope will be a series of ongoing workshops on technology. And not just computers, but also cameras and uh, still photography, video photography, video editing, production, um, website design, kind of anything that you might imagine involving technology, that's what these workshops are all about. And the workshops are being held at the Iowa City Public Library Oh, roughly every two weeks we're having them on different nights of the week because, uh, you know, some people have previous obligations for different board meetings or whatever. So we're trying to make these very accessible. They're, of course, free, um, generally last about 90 minutes long. And what's interesting about these workshops is that you can come with uh, your computer or your camera or your you know, iPhone or iPad or whatever you need help with, and you can bring that to the workshop. Um, also, what is appreciated is if people will RSVP ahead of time. It's not required, but if you can go on our Facebook uh, page for the event, and then RSVP will know how many people to expect and also what the general uh, consensus is among people of what topics should be covered, um, because there are a lot of topics to choose from. So this past workshop, it was on uh, September 26th, Monday, just this last Monday, uh, was a big success. Um, there's a saying about uh, somebody who picks up a starfish and throws it back in the ocean and somebody says, you know, there's so many starfish, what difference does it make? Well, it made a difference to that one. So uh, it was a, a rainy Monday night and we only had three or four days lead time to promote last Monday's workshop. So there was one person who showed up. And uh, that's not uncommon uh, for things like this. So anyway, the person though that showed up um, brought a notebook. It was a previously owned notebook, but like new, really nice uh, notebook, and this person is a new to computing, wanted some help getting it going, also wanted some advice to know if this was a good notebook or not, or should they take it back. It was um, purchased locally here at the Goodwill Reboot store. And so I thought, you know, that would be a perfect topic to start out with um, for that first workshop. So what we did was um, using his questions as, as I went along and worked on the computer a little bit, that became the focus of last Monday's workshop. And you can hear the audio to that uh, dialogue. In fact, I, I asked the participant, I said, hey, is it okay to do an audio recording and then share this on the web? He said, that'd be fine. So we have an audio recording of kind of uh, three parts. 90 minutes is the first uh, workshop where um, it's just kind of a back and forth, a little bit of a dialogue there and talking about setting up a new computer or one that's new to you but previously owned. Um, and then a couple more parts where I followed up uh, later in the evening, setting up, uh, continuing actually to work on that notebook. Sometimes it can take, you know, a couple of hours, maybe three hours to really get all of those Windows updates installed and that type of thing. So I think this will be really helpful for somebody who um, maybe is on a budget or just doesn't want to spend a lot of money on a computer. So they're going out getting one of these used computers and um, and consequently, you know, they also don't want to spend a lot of money on a specialist to be paid hourly to set up a used computer. So having the audio instruction online guided tour of sorts that will help people in setting up their uh, recently purchased previously owned computers. There are a lot of places in Iowa City and if you're not in our area you're watching this uh, on the web probably in your area as well where you can buy uh, used computers and it's usually a pretty good value. Well anyway that's enough about last uh, week's workshop and I just want to mention that then on Friday October 7th from 6 to 7 30 p.m. at the Iowa City Public Library we're gonna have another one of these workshops and I'd love to hear from those of you out there who plan to come or you know what even if you can't come if you'd like a topic um, covered then then that presentation can be made on Friday and uh, recorded and then shared online so you can uh, get answers to your questions um, even if you're not able to make it to the workshop. So uh, anyway, I appreciate uh, the support that we're getting from everybody on this project and um, hope to hear from you soon. Thanks.